Well, you didn't say that. You made it seem like you were saying the pass was out of bounds. It started out of bounds. Here's Wilkes for three. It's good for Chris Wilkes. If UCLA will execute like that in their set off, lost by six. My computer, like mine, tells me that's a 21-point swing late. 9-0 run right now by UCLA. Wilkes hits the deck hard, hops to his feet as he was fouled. Huh? And Notre Dame offered him, but he, he wasn't having no part of that. He's coming to UCLA. He's coming to California. And when these guys, they come out here, that I got. Chris Wilkes going to the hoop. No stopping him. He's fouled on the drive, and so Wilkes will go to the line already five points. He's been aggressive. Six shot attempts. <laughs> Who is this? This is not Digger. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Undefeated lifetime with <laughs> Booker. Is Digger, this, is, is this for UCLA for years? Sidney Wicks, the greatest college forward I ever saw. Tremendous hands, Jalen Hands. And then a foul on T.J. Gibbs. Good foul. First in the 16th foul. Fourth. Yeah, 16 foul, excuse me, on Notre Dame. Over by Notre Dame, and now the Bruins looking to run. Smith leaves it for Wilkes. Another corner three. Off the mark, out of bounds to Notre Dame. Player, what a human being. Sorry I couldn't deliver for you, Marcus. Wilkes yeah. hits that three. And Wilkes with his second triple. Mike Gray forced to call a time. Starting to fall, and nothing is going down for the Irish. Chris Wilkes, that's in your face, the state of Indiana. Six rebounds, and he's going to be their go-to guy this year, Bill. Why are you so unhappy? UCLA is winning. They're at home. The fans are ecstatic. Chris Wilkes is playing beautifully. Notre Dame went scoreless the final seven minutes and 40 seconds of that half. It was excellent defense by UCLA and also obviously. Nice. The On the move. Fight. Beautiful. That's basketball. That's the drive. The hand back to the space that you created. Jalen Hands, absolutely spectacular. Three-point opportunity for Wilkes. When you look at Chris Wilkes, you mentioned early on about the NBA thinking that he needs more strength. He's just a young guy. He's a sophomore in college. The NBA, that is full of men. Game plan here. Make UCLA play half court. Control the boards. What's the rebound situation? Whoa, that's a tough shot there. And rebounds on the glass. And by Notre Dame going to this zone, that's eliminated a lot of second chance opportunities for UCLA as Wilkes misses a three. They only have two second chance points this half. Hub driving, spinning, rejected by Hill. Lot of oh, he's got it with four. Wilkes with two for three. Good! With a tenth of a second left. Battling cramps. He's injured on the floor. He's excited. Exhausted. College basketball, you can't advance the ball, so they'll have to inbound it from backcourt. It's definitely a three. Let's see how much time on the clock when it goes through the net. About .5, point .6, which... Still, it's going to have to be throw it down the length of the floor, quick catch and shoot for Notre Dame to even have a chance. I think he's cramping as he's in the air there, and he can't even put anything on that leg. Wow. He's got to be helped to the UCLA bench right now. It was Skip Meyer, the trainer for 40 years for the Fighting Irish, who had to come over there and help him. Wow. Okay. Talk about uh, mixed emotions, man. You hit the shot of your coach and Tom Orlich up in Lake Tahoe. Beautiful play. Throw it down. The pressure by UCLA. Full court defense forcing a turnover. Timeout. Stanford. Now this is the celebration of life that college basketball is. We saw Baylor beat you. He said when, he, when Bob Myers made that pick, he said, everybody said, oh, what's he ever done? I would love for you to actually name a, a real possible candidate. Stanford back within 10 with seven to play in the first half. Wilkes from outside, off the mark, just one basket. But they also lost all those games. But they did beat some they teams this them. year. They beat some teams this year they lost to last year, like Long Beach State. There's Wilkes with the jumper, his second field goal. He, he's going to be something. KZ Akpala, sophomore beautiful. from Orange County, 17 points already. Wilkes oh, fouled. On. 
on the way up. It's a third team foul on Stanford. Is here tonight too, and then from there on to the NBA. Lenny Wilkins, incredible. What a force of nature. Jack Ramsey, the coach that made me the best player I ever was. Absolutely spectacular. Another immortal act stats over there. Here's Wilkes. Six points on the night. And they're gonna say Ryan Reach. I mean, he makes a real point of that. And the entire UC system is fantastic. At it. Wilkes gets the second free throw. UCLA is not shooting the ball well at the shoot that. Yeah, I don't want Alex to shoot every time. The guy's a wonderful player. Here's Wilkes. That was a good skip pass. And Wilkes pays it off with a triple. I'm just brokenhearted when I see get the NBA involved and come up with a real plan. We well, have to get the NBA involved. It's their right. rule. Wilkes goes for the dunk. Missed it. But a foul is called on Sharma, and that is four. And you think, and I'm with you, that the, the one-and-done rule has hurt the Pac-12 more than the other conferences because Why? we're no, seeing no. all the NBA look. players and, and okay. th that are leaving. And look at UCLA. Imagine that team two years ago with team. And Kentucky's got so many of those guys. And Duke, Duke has Duke so has much talent guys. That, that they can overcome the roster. Before we know I, it, I'm willing to learn to love others. <laughs> what do you have against Demarcus Cousins? What did he do to you? <laughs> Chris Wilkes with the slam. And the lead back to 16. The Bruins pulling away here late in the second.